Hey guys, AJ here, back with another one for you. So guys, we all know that women despise each other. <laughs> In life, women's worst enemy will always be other other women. Despite all this foolishness that they try and say on the internet about, oh yeah, this sisterhood, and we're all in it together, sister. I am woman, hear me roar, in numbers too big to ignore. Clown world. Guys, a woman's worst enemy will always be a woman. They always try and blame us men, right? And try and draw battle lines with with men on one one side and women on the other, not knowing that it's other other women stabbing them in the back. So as I've made videos in the past, about how women treat each other like trash at work. But I realized I didn't make any videos about about girls treating each other like trash, period. So I'm gonna do that right now. <laughs> so this is gonna be a series, guys. So we're gonna go to the dumpster fire known as TikTok. Look at these chicks basically saying everything that we've known forever. But before we do that, guys, like, subscribe, drop a comment, because it really helps keep the, the channel going. You guys are watching this on Crumble. Please go over to my YouTube. And check out the playlist if you're watching this on YouTube. Guys, check out the playlist link at the, at the end. I have a second channel in the description, guys. And let's get into this. Personally, I think women are actually more competitive than men in a lot of ways. There because it is. they're always competing with other women. We there are also taught at a young age to play the head games that we play on men in relationships. But with each other, we're taught to not express ourselves fully and be blunt. And when I say taught, I'm not justifying it all. Once you pass a certain age, as a woman, we need to hold ourselves accountable for this behavior and work through it and stop with that bullshit. But what ends up happening is a lot of women continue this throughout their lives. A lot of women have friends that they don't even like. It just brings me I thought that women were emotionally intelligent and that us men had so much to learn about. <clears throat> Our emotions, clown world, right? Tend to like them. They look for a man that they can brag about to their friends and one up them with it. Or you'll see women give their friends bad advice on purpose, yep. sabotage them. As I've gotten older, I've become extremely careful with the women I surround myself with. I try to find women friends who are brutally honest Good and luck. call me out on my shit. Also ones that genuinely care about me. And Good I luck. do the same for them, of course. <laughs> But unfortunately, a lot of women are master manipulators. You have to be careful, and that's why a lot of women hate each other, because they're fully aware of that. I think there are a lot there of- There it is, guys. She said it. Every And she is right. Every Everything that women do to men in relationships, you know, gaslighting, manipulation, all this other stuff, they do to each other. Right? <laughs> and it's so funny, because- if we say this as guys, guys. How dare you? <laughs> and guys are hashtags. Hashtag toxic friends. Hashtag women's empowerment. Hashtag advice. Hashtag real friend friendship, guys. Clown work. It's honestly one of the things I hate most about women. Honestly. We are each other's worst enemy. It's like we think that some other woman is like our competition. We don't think of them as a sister or somebody that has walking in the same, has had to walk in the same shoes and has had to deal with some of the things that we all deal with because we're all women. There it is. You know, the one thing I'll say about men is that men tend to come together. Yeah, Women, we be, we are the <laughs> worst ones to each other. We and guys, that is so true, right? Guys, see, men, we have a pack mentality, right? And this is what I mean by by this, guys. Put in the com com comments if you've been at like a you know uh, a football game or in in the U UK a football match, right? <laughs> a baseball game, <clears throat> any sporting event, right? And a bunch of dudes wearing the other team's jerseys were talking shit, right? Yo, you and a bunch of dudes that you don't know, but because you have the same jersey on, will actually band band together as a pack and get in the other dudes' faith faces. And you guys, who let's just say you're Eagles fans or your Cowboys fans, you guys will have each other's backs. You guys don't know each other. <laughs> Yo, that's how that's how easily men come together. You know what I'm saying? It's crazy. Look at that. But girls could never be able to do do that ever. We be tearing each other down 
in, in the worst ways. That is such a hard thing for me to accept and receive, which is why I started Power Up to begin with, because I wanted Good luck. women, more women to come together and support each other just as aggressively as we tear each other down. It's sad to me. If I well, guys, it, she actually thinks her little Facebook group is going to is going to make chicks stop hating on each other. Sorry, lady. You've been hanged. Hey guys, are hashtags, hashtag women, hashtag enemies, hashtag friend of uh, frenemies, hashtag competition, hashtag insecurity, hashtag jealousy, hashtag jealousy is a disease, hashtag jealousy issues, hashtag positive vibes only, hashtag women should support other women, hashtag period, hashtag where is the love, look, look at that guys, clown world. I need somebody to help me understand what do bitches these types of women are going to be around you for one of two reasons Either they want to get around you so that they can try to steal your personality and then figure out what about you makes you you so that they can try to imitate it because they think you're just this grand great person or they might want to get close to you so that they can try to sabotage you in some way and then try to prove to themselves that you ain't as great as they think you are <laughs> not as perfect and your life isn't as perfect as they think it is when in reality you never said that nobody said that or is even pretending that but they've made up this like fantasy about you in their head that you just this great person you so beautiful you so smart you so talented successful whatever it is and they take that and go oh no there's no way that this bitch is about to be in the same room as me in the same space outshining me being prettier than me whatever getting all the attention so i gotta look at that guys think about that <laughs> everywhere these girls go they think this this way there's girls out there that are oh oh this heifer ain't pretty than me she guys, guys don't give i give a damn the only thing guys look at other dudes is, yo, if it's me and my three friends and we go, go to the bar and a place that we don't know, like, who who can we fight and, and beat up just in case something pops off? But other than that, we don't care. You understand? I gotta try to knock her down to make myself look better or feel better. These women got insecurities, low self-esteem. It'll never go away until they really look inside and like work that out. Cause all of it stems from low confidence. Cause if you are, if you confident and securing yourself, you're not about to be walking around here doing that to other women, especially women that you don't even know. And a lot of times if you pay attention, the girls that do this before they approach you, usually they always approach you to be your friend. But before that even happens, they've already been studying you and watching you from a distance. You just didn't know it. They know who you are before you know who they are. And it's funny cause all of these chicks are that are jealous of each other, hate on each other. Guys, you notice that they're always friends on social media? And then something will pop pop off and it's, <coughs> right? <laughs> In a huge fight and everyone gets, gets involved, da, 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 and then they're chill afterwards. But all they're, all, the, all they're doing is keeping each other, like right in each other's orbit just so they can hate on each other. And guys, more and more, Young boys raised by single moms are acting this way, which is really, 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 really sad. All right, guys, us men in in gen, general, we make friends easy, we keep friends easy, right? We have a pack mentality, so a lot of us don't got to worry about this. But these chicks are cooked, man. They're done for. So, all right, you guys, this is AJ. I pre appreciate you guys like, subscribe, and I'm out of here, guys. Have a good.